Hey guys, it's me, Ted Robleski again. I am going to be showing you the place command. Uh, right now, this is the third time she's actually done this today. I've actually done two other videos and I realized that I'm very monotone in it and I was falling asleep listening to it. But um, she's been actually in this position for about five minutes already while I was checking out the videos that I made. Kona also was in position here too. He was put into place earlier uh, while we were working on her and they both have, have not left place. Um, Kona release. Release good boy. So I released him from from his place and just like the bartender says you don't have to go home but you can't stay here same thing she, he had to leave that spot and did, he could do anything he wants right now and he's hovering over us not a big deal uh, but other than that he did not have to stay there once I said release so we have princess here and princess is she's a little nervous she definitely um, she doesn't know what what to do Right? And I'm going to actually guide her into making better decisions. And one of the decisions is place. So when she's feeling anxious or anything like that, I could tell her to go to place and she will lay down. And when the dog lays down, it gets to shut his um, mind off, shut the brain off, and um, just do nothing. Soak it in. Soak in nothing. Okay? So see how she actually backed away from me? She's still nervous about me. So I'm actually going to back away from her space just so that she's comfortable. Right? I, I, um, right now, I need to build my trust with her. Okay? So, but this is how we do place. So come on. Good girl. Uh, 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 uh. She wants the bigger bed. So I'm going to apply pressure until she gets off of that. I'm going to let her make the choice to get off of this too. I move to make it easier for her to make the right choice to move. Kona, go to bed. Kona, go to bed. Go. Ah, uh ah. -uh. No. Today's his birthday. He thinks he could get away with everything. Right. So, I usually work on the left hand side of my body. I'm going to work on the right hand side just because of the position of the camera and everything. All right. So, we approach the mat and I go, place. And I physically stop here right in the middle of the mat because where I stop, she's, she's going to stop. You know, she's not going to go ahead of me. But if I stopped here, then she would have stopped here. So that's why I stop in the middle of the mat. And what I'm going to do is just apply a little bit of pressure. And she finally sat down. Good. Okay, good girl. So again, we're going to come back here. Then this is where the repetition works. Okay. So you go, place. Again, I stopped right here. See, she's kept on going a little further. So I'm going to just back up a little bit. And see how she's following me? I'm not applying a lot of pressure on the leash she's making the decisions herself and this is how she will learn this is how most dogs learn all right so i'm going to do this again place and notice when i use the word place when i'm going to first finish this thought off good girl okay so when i use the command place right I am, come I am right here, and see, like, right before her nose crosses the, the, the imaginary line here of the mat, this is where I use the word place, and then what I do is I step this way. And see, and I stop, she stops. And this is how you do the place command. So, eventually, she's gonna, we're gonna uh, spread things out where, I might be standing over there and I'll tell her to place and she's going to come here by herself. But this is how we introduce the place command. Good girl. Place. Good girl. 
I did that a little prematurely because when I say good, her foot actually was off of place, and I want I want all four legs on place right now. Let's do that again. So see, I see place, and I stop right here. I'm gonna good, good girl, good girl. I'm giving her just a little minor touches. Now, she should know by now to really stay on it. So I'm going to use spatial pressure to kind of get her back on. Uh, she, you know, I'm going to do it right now whatever I can to get her back on. I try spatial pressure. She didn't acknowledge that, but she acknowledged me coming to over here. So we'll, we'll do this one more time. And I highly recommend ending on a good note. Place. And that was a good note. Okay. Another thing what we could do though is we can introduce the down. So, uh, 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 uh. so right now she's she's on, on, on the map. And the down command, I'm just applying a little bit of pressure down. I'm not applying really much at all. If anything, it was, you wouldn't even feel it, probably like a fly landing on you. That's how much pressure I was doing down. And she knew to actually lay down. So this, we're going to end this on a good note. This is it. She's going to stay here for 5, 10, 15 minutes. We're going to do duration work. And it's actually snowing outside. But... Uh, this is Ted Robleski with Alpha Dog Dog Training, and I hope you find this very useful.